This AR remains unique, and it remains unique in, because it's a, a, a particular crossroads. It's a crossroads for creative work in art, for creative work about art and anthropology, and a place that brings that together in a very, very distinctive regional space, a space where Native American history is so powerfully part of our lives here in, in New Mexico. SAR has a different and a much more engaged relationship to the community that it's situated in. SAR has a different and much more engaged and unique relationship to the indigenous community that we are part of by where we are located and what the school's intellectual history is, both with the material culture and the, and the uh, Indian Arts Research Center and the you know, expanded outreach to really make this a place where Native American researchers as well as artists you know, have, have a home alongside other kinds of people who are doing intellectual inquiry. And when you throw into that mix the art part, the part that, that's, that really is a wild card, you know, it, it, the way that it can shake things up it, and the way it sort of challenges researchers to be more creative and to put their work in the context of all of the forms of creativity, all the forms of human invention that are ongoing and the ways that those are powerfully related to solving problems. In the, in the contemporary world and powerfully related to talking to and across and you know healing all kinds of differences. The idea that you can be with four or five, six other people and really learn you know, what's important to them and why at whatever stage of their career from pre-doctoral all the way to senior scholar, that's a really unique thing. It's a, it creates an absolutely unique opportunity for people to think in new ways.